Thank you, Jesus, for dying for us on the cross. Without you, there is no hope for healing. There is no hope for our lives. We recognize that you are the resurrection and the life. We cannot come to the Father without going through you. You are our Lord. You are our refuge. We stand on your promises in John 14, where you say that you are the way, the truth, and the life. So we come to you for healing. You also state that whatever we ask in your name, this you will do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. If we ask anything in your name, you will do it. Glory be to God. You also say in John 14, that peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. Not as the world gives do I give to you. We stand on the promise of peace in our healed bodies. For you do not give as the world gives. Our hearts will not be troubled, nor will our hearts be afraid. We thank you, Father, that because of you, We have the authority to speak this prayer of healing, and so we thank you. Thank you for blessing our integumentary system, which comprises our skin, that protects our internal organs, and prevents water loss from our bodies. Our skin is working in perfect functioning order. It excretes waste from our pores, regulates body temperature, and allows us to feel touch, pressure, and painful stimuli. Our skin continues to serve as the first line of defense against infection and changes in temperature. Our skin houses our melanocytes and other cells that gives us our skin color, perfectly chosen by you. We thank you that we are protected from dehydration because of our skin. We perspire appropriately, allow waste to be excreted properly. Our skin generates vitamin D appropriately when exposed to sunlight. Our skin holds our body in perfect form. We thank you that it is adequately protecting us from UV rays. We thank you, Father, for perfect skin. There are no rashes, acne, psoriasis, rosacea, atopic dermatitis, eczema, sunburn, impetigo, skin infection, or skin cancer. There is no yeast infection, athlete's foot, albinism, or cold sores. We pray against any autoimmune attack against our skin and hair follicles. Because of what Jesus has done on the cross, the following autoimmune diseases must bow. Alopecia areata autoimmune dermatitis, autoimmune urticaria, dermatitis herpetiformis, discoid lupus erythematosus, erythroderma, nodosum, lichen planus, lichen palanopilaris, lichen sclerosis, linear immunoglobulin A disease, morphia, pemphigus vulgaris, pityriasis, psoriasis, systemic scleroderma, and vitiligo. Every cell that is attacking our hair follicle must bow to the authority of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every cell that is causing tingling, itching, discomfort, burning, and pain must bow to the Son of God, who is the way, the truth, and the life, the resurrection and the life. Every autoimmune attack on our integumentary system must bow and is a part of Jesus' footstool. We speak peace to our skin. We speak peace to our scalp. There is no more hair loss. All hair loss has come to a halt in the mighty name of Jesus. We speak to our follicles, hair, and scalp and say, God bless you. We bless you the same way Jesus spoke blessing into the tree that was dead, but his word gave it new life. We command every cell in our scalp hair follicles in our body to bow to the authority and word of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, and his word is healing. We envision our hair growing beautifully and healthily 
and all the way down our back. This is a new time for our health. We speak to our fingernails and toenails and speak healing to them. There is no more green nail syndrome, ingrown toenail, onychomycosis, acute paronychia, chronic paronychia, tumors of the nails, verruca vulgari. We will live out all the days of our life in perfect health and perfect peace. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you. We thank you that you sit at the right hand of our Heavenly Father. We thank you for your healing grace. By your stripes, we are healed. We walk in the authority of those stripes on your back. We walk in the authority of the holes in your hands and your feet. That is evidence. That is evidence for us. You still live. You resurrected all for us, all to be joint heirs with you, all to remove sin from us, all to remove iniquity from us. Therefore, by your stripes, we are healed. We say it with authority. We say it as a joint heir in your name. We say it as children of God. We are also his children. We thank you for what you have done for us, Jesus. We thank you, Lord God, the father of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. That is our God. The father, the God who opened the Red Sea for the Israelites. That is our God. The God who spoke to Moses in the burning bush. That is our God. That is our God. And we receive healing from our God. Jesus Christ of Nazareth came because of our God. And so we thank you. We thank you, Lord God, for sending your begotten Son for our healing. We are being healed right now as we speak. We are being healed right now as we speak the word into our bodies. We speak healing into our bodies. We know that there is truth and power in the tongue, in the living word of God. There is truth and power in our tongues, and we speak it today. We speak our healing today. We walk in authority today. There is no more itching, tingling, discomfort, poor sleep from the scratching. We are finally delivered, we are free. Whom the one sets free is free indeed, and we are free. We are free. We are free. We have peace according to John 14. He leaves our peace with us, with our healing. His peace he gives to us. His peace. A peace that surpasses knowledge and understanding is ours through Christ Jesus. There is peace because our bodies are healed. Our skin is healed. Our nails are healed. We walk in the healing grace and authority of Jesus Christ. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you that our hair is the crown of your glory. All glory and honor belongs to you, Almighty Father. We thank you in your precious name. We thank you in your precious name because of your precious blood. We thank you, Father in heaven. Glory and honor are yours, Almighty Father. We seal this prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.